Hello guys, Sanjay here and as you can see I have the Moto X Play with me and in this video I am going to review a ROM for the Moto X Play and that is going to be Cyanogen Mod 12.1 There are multiple ROMs that are released for the device and uh, that's surely a very good thing and this indicates that the future of the device on XT at least is going to be very very bright and there are developers who are working really hard for the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 and all the other ROMs which are available are based on Cyanogen Mod 12.1. Uh, there are few ROMs based on AOSP also uh, and people are saying that those ROMs are also good. So in this video I am going to review the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 for the Moto X Play as of now and in this video I will show you guys how to install a ROM on the Moto X Play and that guide will be at the end of this video so stay tuned for that. And uh, let's get into the review of Cyanogen Mod 12.1. And once you install the Cyanogen Mod 12.1, you will see uh, your launcher is like this, which is like completely unconventional. So to remove that, long press on the home screen, swipe up and just select drawer setting layout as paged and it will turn out to be normal now. So as you can see, it is normal. And if we go into settings and then if we go into about phone you can see that it is based on Cyanogen Mod 12.1 and as this is Cyanogen Mod 12.1 it is based on Android 5.1.1 so that's quite obvious but if you want to enable the root access on the device then tap on the build number 7 times to enable the developer options over here so here are the developer options then go down and select root access and select apps only if you want the root access to be given to apps only and if you are going to use some ADB commands uh, which may require root access then you can select apps and ADB also. So I have to say that overall the ROM is very very good, the performance of the ROM is also very good and the camera performance is also very good. So as you can see the front facing camera is clicking really nice pictures. Okay so this was quite shaky so let's click a good picture. That was a huge smile but anyways. So as you can see the picture is looking pretty good and I have clicked many more pictures with the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 ROM and uh, I am quite amazed with the performance of the ROM with camera and uh, and yes the camera surely performs very very good with the ROM. And now I will show you some of the tricks that are not present in the stock AOSP ROM that we have on the Moto X Play. So you can change many things like you can download themes. So if you want to download themes then hit on get more select play store. And from here you can download any ROM that you want. So let's assume that we want this ROM. Select install, select accept. So the theme is installed now. Once again if you go into themes then that theme will be present over here. And now to apply this theme select all these options and hit apply. And now the theme will be applied. So yeah, deep darkness theme is applied. And everything is changed according to the theme. So that's surely a very nice thing and this thing it's surely not available on the stock AOSP ROM and you cannot do that very easily and there are tons of customization options in the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 for the Moto X Play and there are even more customization options in the Blisspop ROM which is already released for the Moto X Play so you can install the Blisspop ROM if you like customization in status bar if you go then you can select clock at the center if you want AM PM then you can select that and uh, battery percentage. This is the feature which I turn on every time I install a Cyanogen Mod 12.1 ROM. So I like to have a battery percentage. So circle with a battery percentage inside it looks like really really cool. So basically the performance of the ROM is very very good no issues whatsoever. The ROM is buttery smooth and almost everything is working. There are one two bugs which will be mentioned on the XDA thread. And thanks to both the developers who are working on the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 for the Moto X Play. And I am really glad to see such type of development with the Moto X Play. And uh, now let's get to the part where I will show you how to install the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 or any ROM for that matter on your Moto X Play. So to do this you need to have TWRP recovery installed on your device. And if you do not have TWRP recovery installed or if you have not unlocked your bootloader or your phone's bootloader yet then uh, I have already made a video for that and I uh, will give the link of that video in the description box below. So if you want to install this ROM then you need to install the TWRP recovery and uh, you can simply follow that guide and install TWRP recovery. After you have installed TWRP recovery simply power off your phone and uh, once the phone is powered off hold the volume down and the power button together and once you see something like this just leave the button and 
press the volume down button till you see recovery mode and to go into recovery mode select the power button and we will boot into the recovery mode that is TWRP for our device. So as you can see we have booted into the TWRP recovery and the first thing that you should do and you have to do is that back up the current ROM. So if anything goes wrong by mistake then you can simply restore this backup and you can come back to the ROM that you had earlier in your case that will be stock ROM. Uh, yeah, so do backup your ROM and to backup just simply swipe to backup and it will backup the complete ROM. And after the backup is done, go into wipe and select swipe to factory reset. This will wipe the data cache and Elvik cache. So you do not have to wipe anything uh, separately. And that's a good thing with the TWRP recovery. And uh, now go into install and now select the CM12.1 package zip file. Okay, so this is the package. Select that zip file, select swipe to confirm flash. And once that is done, go into home again, select install and select the GAPS package that will be linked in the description box below. So both the links, both the zip files will be linked in the description box below. So do not worry about the links. You can simply check out the links in the description box below. And once the zip installation is completed, select home select reboot and select system and now the device will boot into the cyanogen mod 12.1 in my case but if you have installed any other rom like blisspop rom or aosp rom then your device will boot into the respective rom so i'll just confirm that by the boot logo so yes as you can see the boot logo is over here and this boot logo is of cyanogen mod so this is how you can install Cyanation Mod 12.1 or any rom on the moto x play so yeah this is it for this video guys thank you for watching don't forget to hit the like button if you like this video and let's see if we can reach 100 likes on this video. So yeah, do hit that like button if you like this video. And for many more videos on the Moto X Play, do hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Because yes, videos on the Moto X Play will be coming in the future on the channel. So you don't want to miss that. So do hit this subscribe button over here. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you for watching.